Moving on this Monday, the Bakersfield Homeless Center's mission is to help individuals and families get back on their feet and into a home of their own. But that's not all they do. The mission also helps its clients put gifts under their Christmas trees each year. That is why the Adopt a Family program was created. 23 ABC's Rosar Simone sat down with CEO of BHC, Lauren Skidmore, to learn more about the program's initiatives. Making your list and checking it twice is a huge tradition for families who celebrate Christmas. But what about those who are just trying to make ends meet? Well, that's where the Adopt a Family program comes in. So these families are really in need of some of the basic items because they are still engaging in how to um, pay bills and ensure that their um, utility is met, that they're you know making sure their children are going to school and all of the things that we take for granted. There are 200 Kern County families who will be celebrating the holidays for the first time off the streets and in their new home. And while that's a blessing, there are still some things families couldn't pick up this year. Families in the Bakersfield Homeless Center Aftercare Program create their Christmas list that is posted on the Adopt a Family website, where residents can choose to donate any or all items on their wish list. You can stay an anonymous Santa or you can arrange to meet the family in person. Um, you know, Garces High School, for example, they adopt almost 20 families just from their school alone where they get students, teachers and staff all involved. CEO of the Bakersfield Homeless Center, Lawrence Gidmore, says seeing the students donate so much warms her heart every year. Most of the time, you know, when we show our children um, a different form of society, um, they will give back throughout their lives. And I think it's really important to engage, you know, young children, any age children. Not to mention the impact these gifts have on the aftercare families and their children. We got word that once her daughter came home, she started crying and was very emotional because she saw a tree in her living room and she saw presents under that tree, something that she had been missing out for many years. Um, this year, Skidmore has an exciting announcement. We have all of our families adopted for the 2021 year. We are so grateful because we are filling up their homes with gifts. Um, there has been a whole host of support. 